This question says, an improvement in production technology will do which of the following? And so it will shift the supply curve to the right, shift the supply curve to the left, cause an upward movement on the supply curve or cause a downward movement on the supply curve. So that's a good question. Um, again, a lot of exam questions I've seen are gonna test your, your knowledge of the difference between a movement along the curve versus a movement of the curve, right? And so, um, you know, we can, we, we, when we saw, talk about movement of the curve, we're normally talking about shifts. And, uh, you know, the question is when production technology is improved, is that going to cause a shift or a movement? And if it does cause a shift or a movement, in which way is that shift or movement? In which direction? So let's talk about that first, first uh, question. Is this a shift or a movement? And so we know that the only thing that causes there to be movement along the supply curve is price change, right? Any other change in a, a determinant of supply that is, you know, not price is going to result in a shift. And so because uh, technology improvement is not price change, we know that, you know, three and four are not going to be right because those refer to movements and that's not what we're talking about here. So the next question then is going to be, is this, if this is a shift, is it going to increase supply or decrease supply? Is it going to shift to the right or to the left? And when we're talking about improvements of production technology. We know that production technology is a determinant of supply. And if technology improves, we assume that given the same amount of resources, uh, suppliers or producers are going to be able to create more and produce more goods. And so that would be a increase in quantity supplied for every price level. And that translates into a shift in the supply curve to the right. And so we would say that answer choice number one would be the right answer. So we would see something along the lines of, uh, it would look something like this, right? So taking a look at the answer key, um, let's make sure that's uh, what we actually see. So yes, uh, the answer key says uh, a shift in the supply curve to the right. And so let's take a look at uh, the, the uh, explanation given. The explanation given says an improvement in production technology will decrease the average cost of production for a firm making it more profitable for the firm to sell a greater output. This is true, right? Because if you can, uh, if we think of average cost of production as uh, total cost uh, divided by quantity produced, right? If we can produce higher amounts of quantity, then the average uh, production, uh, average cost is going to go down. Right, and so um, it's going to make it more profitable for the firm to sell a greater output. This is true. So the profit motive of the ration producer leads to an increase in the supply of the product, shifting the supply curve to the right. Right. So we can go the, the equation route, or we could also go the uh, you know kind of the more abstract theoretical route of you know if it costs less to produce, you can increase product productivity with the same amount of resources, then you would increase the uh, supply at all levels. Uh, the decrease in cost increases the supply, shifting the curve, which indicates that the quantity supply to each price has increased, right? And upward downward on the supply curve indicates a change in quantity supplied due to the price and not a change in the supply entirely. So great, this is a good answer. It, it clarifies both the rationale for why supply is changing and shifting. And it also clarifies that you only see movement when you have a change in the quantity supplied due to the price. And so I think that's a great answer and I don't think there's anything we need to change here.